We're gonna find some water ball, water, water balls. What's been the worst part of the trip? Not having friends. It's a snake? Yep. Oh, cool. Hey there, friends. We're the Browns. Chad, Katie, Addison, Kenya, and Milo. We live for love and adventure. In November of 2017, we sold our house and most our possessions in pursuit of simplicity and freedom. Two months later, we bought a 2001 Bluebird school bus to make our home. After building out the bus for six months, we've been on the open road full time. Our family motto is love always, adventure often. We're stoked for you to join our journey and hope you enjoy watching our videos as much as we love making them. So hit subscribe and enjoy the adventure. Hey, what's happening my friends? We are still in Central Oregon Bend area, just exploring. We're on this beautiful lake today with sailboats and paddle boarders and all that kind of stuff. This has been an interesting week. It's worked out a bit differently than we anticipated. Um, Katie's grandma went into hospice earlier this week and so she's expected to kind of pass any day now and so that's making our plans a little bit tricky. I also got a couple of uh, gigs in Bend area, um, well Central Oregon area that I'm going to be hanging around for for a little while in my business and, and um, so we're going to be here for a while which I will not complain in the least. <laughs> This place is amazing. Obviously, some of the circumstances aren't the most ideal with Katie's grandma, but uh, we're making it work. And we've got a couple days here together, and then I think Katie and the kids are gonna head back to Salt Lake area for a funeral and help wrap all of that kind of stuff up. And I'll be exploring here solo. We'll see what happens. And uh, I'll take you along for the ride, but look at this lake. It's incredible. I mean, why would you ever want to leave? So unbelievable. Yeah. I really hope not. But it feels like <laughs> I'm coming down with something. Oh really? Yeah. Like a case of the giggles? <laughs> no, <laughs> I need to buy peaches today. Peaches, that's it. So I'm making a pie today. That's, Katie's gonna, Katie's gonna bake. She's gonna mourn by baking. So we found out this morning that Katie's grandma passed, who was in hospice at her parents' house. And so today is our, before these guys take off for Salt Lake, today's our last day in Bend together. So we're gonna go find some adventure. We're gonna find some water ball, water, water balls. So we're gonna go find some waterfalls here close to town and explore a little bit before these guys take off in the morning. All right, we are on our way out to a place called Tumalo Falls. Tumalo. And uh, we can hike around, find some falls, get some sun. We'll find out. It's by far the hottest day we've experienced here so far. And so we're gonna go find some water, some cool down like we haven't been doing that, but we're gonna do it again today. More, more water, more waterfalls. Always waterfalls. Always waterfalls. You can never go wrong with waterfalls, right? Yeah. Right. Okay, 
I love falling water. Let's go. All right, we're here. Looks like it might be a little bit crowded. There's a bit of people. Let's go see what this is all about. And it's slanted. Our parking spot's slanted. Very. Maybe we should just turn around and go home. Yeah, probably. So Addison, mm -hmm. what do you think of our trip so far? Or That's our good. life? I keep calling it a trip. I think it just needs to be called life, right? Uh-huh. It's good? Uh-huh. What else? Uh, what do you like about it? I don't know. That we get to do a lot of adventure stuff. So far it's been a lot of lakes and I like lakes. Which which lake's been your favorite or which adventure's been your favorite? Elk. Whatever. Elk. Yesterday? Yeah. Elk Lake? Yesterday. Yeah, you guys were in the water for like four hours. Yeah. And yeah. What's and been the Rock City. Rock City was awesome. What's been the worst part of the trip? Not having friends. Yeah. I mean, there's been tons of friends, but my best friends at home. Yep, that's hard. We all left a lot of good friends, huh? Mm -hmm. For my daughter and her family. Wow, guys. Archie fish. Let's keep the aisle for Archie fish. So you come right into the parking lot and go right to the bottom of the falls and now we're hiking up to the top to go see. What's wrong? I already should be tired. You're super tired? Yeah. Why? Because we're already super high. We're already super high? Yeah. But we've only gone like, we've only been walking for like five minutes. Found the secret trail to the bottom of the waterfall. Nobody else is on it. We're gonna be the only ones down here. We found this little side trail, this shoot off that took us to the bottom of the waterfall. Virtually nobody is down here. We just crossed some other people, just barely been down here playing underneath the waterfall for like 20 minutes and absolutely nobody. This is awesome. How's that? That was awesome. Mike! Yeah. Look at me. How was that? Fun. That was fun? Yeah. We were a little disappointed when we got here because when we go to waterfalls we want to be like underneath them and that's where you get like the real feeling of their grandeur and and beauty in my opinion not from the top looking down so we were scrambling to find a way down here found a nice little trail had it all to ourselves i feel like we had a unique experience here so this is the morning that katie and the kids leave I head back to utah for the funeral and uh, we just picked up the rental car Got, uh, got upgraded to a minivan for free, which was awesome. Makes me feel a whole lot better with them driving a minivan 10, 11 hours instead of a small economy car. So just picked up the rental car. We're gonna go back, load it up, and they're out of here. And I won't see them for a week, and neither will you. Milo, where are you going, bud? Uh, the McDonald's. You gonna go see the McDonald's? Yeah. And we're gonna see our baby Charlie and then um, Papa. Yeah. Not McDonald's the restaurant, right? Nope. <laughs> our best friends are called the McDonald's. Yeah. One's yeah. named Wyatt, Lacey, and Rob, and Izzy and Ed. Yeah, and you get to go back and see them. But Dad doesn't. No, nope. Daddy's gonna stay here in bed. I'm gonna miss you, Miss Kenya. I'm gonna miss you. My, love. My back usually hoots when I ride on this thing. My you look back. like you're gonna miss me. You look happy. <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> Road tripping in the minivan. Two, give me loves. Oh. Give me loves. Oh, I love you. Have fun, okay? So one thing about the space that we live in, how small our home is, is it's really hard to get things done when the whole family's here because lots of people are in the bus, in and out of the bus, and in different areas of the bus, and then tools. Even just getting tools out and putting them out on the floor just takes up so much space. So while they're gone, it's the perfect opportunity to get some of these things done that I need to get done. So as much as I'm missing them, and I'm missing them so much and they've only been gone a couple hours. This is a fantastic opportunity to get some of the things done. And plus, it'll be exciting. They'll come back and some of these things will be done and they'll be excited about it. Maybe. Hopefully. Probably not. Okay, so the first thing I'm working on today is uh, fire extinguishers. When I first, when we first built the bus and took off and all that kind of stuff, I neglected to put fire, fire, a couple of fire extinguishers in different places in the bus. So I'm going to, I don't quite know yet where yet, but I'm going to install in fire ex, a fire extinguisher in the kitchen and then a fire extinguisher back in our bedroom near the water heater. I think those are two good central locations to have extinguishers and they're also the areas that use fuel and flammables. <laughs> All right, my friends, here's the deal. My family has been gone for a full week and I have done very little filming. <laughs> and I still haven't finished the things that I wanted to finish on the bus that I started the day they left. So I'm gonna work, they're gonna be here in just a couple hours. Now I'm gonna be a good boy and work really hard to get some of these things done before they get here. And uh, I'll show you what I'm doing. Kenya. Hello. <laughs> Hello. Stick to the shore, Addison. Stick to the shore. We're going that way. I'm just doing some filming. Don't worry about me. You paddle. All paddle right. more. So we are in a place called Palina, and we are kayaking, paddle boarding to some hot springs. We're gonna picnic our dinner. What are we doing, Kenya? Paddling. Paddling, paddling. Where are we going? Oh, these look so cool. Where are we going, bud? I don't no. know. I don't know. We can go find some hot springs. Come here. Come here. Hot springs. Now we can see how hot they really are. Woohoo! Oh, they're hot. We made it to the hot springs. It's awesome. There's like probably nine of them along this shore. Beautiful. What do you got there, buddy? Oh, it's a snake. It's a snake? Yep. Oh, cool. Now, can I have a turn? What's his name? Um, his name is. He needs to run. His name is. His 
name is Orange Stripes. Orange Stripes? No, Yellow Stripes. <laughs> yellow yeah, Stripes? I would just name him Stripes. Wow, thank you so much for watching. Hope you enjoy seeing our videos as much as we love making them. Don't miss a single adventure or bus moment. Make sure you hit subscribe and share with everyone you know. We'll see you next week and remember to love always and adventure often.